Hello subscribers, welcome to a live stream of AD&D's Curse of the Azure Bonds. We are doing a new Iron Man challenge run. We're going to be doing three cleric rangers and three fighter magic users. So half elves with 18 wisdom can only have uh, level 5 cleric, that's the highest we can get. And, well, the wisdom doesn't affect that. The wisdom affects the number of bonus spells. We need 17 wisdom to max out our bonus spells. And ranger, they can only go to level 8 if they have 18 strength. So that's what we're going for. And of course, high dexterity is a must. Let's see the highest tip points we can get. It's like 40-ish. Low 40s. Alright. <clears throat> hey, Sever, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? He says, oh, sounds like a party I would make. Oh, is it? It's going to probably take me a while to roll the stats I need. We hit our level caps in this game for sure, based on the race. Oh man, this would have been good, except the dexterity is terrible. Sever gets the first character named after him. Ooh. This is pretty good. Hit points are uh, mediocre. The rest is good. We'll worry about the icons later. Right, I do need to delete some characters here. And so I have They're obviously characters that are transferred. Get rid of them. Hey, Crimson, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Sever says only D will not crack the level limit because D doesn't cheat like I do. <laughs> it's only really the last hit point that counts, Crimson says. That's true. That is true. Okay. Oh, I think I deleted. I did. I deleted the Sever character. These characters won't go away. Ah. Bo and Duncan are permanent. They can't go away. Well, let's redo. Cleric Ranger. So again, we're looking for 18 strength, 17 wisdom, and preferably 18 dexterity. Dexterity is too low. Mmm. Holy moly, okay. Definitely keeping this. All right. Next is Crimson. He will get a character. The Cleric Ranger.
Crimson says, I imagine all these dismissed characters just milling about despondently outside the Adventures Guild. The unemployment rate of Hills Far just quadrupled. <laughs> That's funny. That would actually make a great game. You know? You could make like a Hills Far type clone. There's just all these adventures wandering about uh this one would have been pretty good except the constitution yeah hit points are too low sever says cleric ranger probably cleric of malachi the goddess of most rangers yeah you don't get a pick that in uh these games like you do in Kren. Kren world. Dang, he won't get a bonus level third spell if I go with this. Uh not doing it as much as I want to. Dexterity is too low. And Drizz, yeah. Most popular drow elf ever. Oh. Dexterity of 16. I, I can't do it. It's too bad. Seventeen. Seventeen con. This I will take. Hey, Moody, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? <laughs> Couldn't watch some of the streams early in the day scam. <laughs> uh, no, I have not had party wipes. This is just a new run. It's a crimson. Uh, let's see. Add. Next, another cleric ranger. Moody is the third character. Hey, Zachary, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Crimson said there's an interesting indie game, Diary of a Spaceport Janitor. I, I'm guessing that's about what? Space Quest? The guy in Space Quest? Where all the shops have magic swords and plasma armor and laser guns for like 400,000 credits while you struggle to put together eight credits for some less moldy than usual noodles. Oh, that's funny. You're doing good, Zachary. Glad to hear that. It's a misty spring morning. I am doing good. I'm finally feeling a lot better from COVID. Tomorrow would be the two-week mark. Let's see. Wisdom's too low. That's seventeen wisdom. No, Dex is too low.
we'll take less than 17 dex. No, hit points and wisdom too low. You're an 8 out of 10, Moody. Glad to hear it. Yes, I am sounding a lot better. Not coughing nearly as often. Being stubborn. Uh, okay, we'll keep this one. That's a good amount of hit points. All right, we got Moody. Zachary will be next. Now we're doing fighter magic users, and these are going to be elves. Eighteen ant, eighteen strength, hopefully eighteen dexterity. Oh, what size tip points we can get? Thirty maybe? Crimson says what you get less divine power just because your wisdom isn't high enough, these gods can be real snobs. <laughs> yeah. That's funny, isn't it? They're jerks. So we do need to get to level 11. We need 18 intelligence. Otherwise, the highest we will reach for magic user would be 10 or 9. And we need 18 strength to become a level 7 fighter. That's the highest elves can go. Dexterity is too low. Hit points are too bad. Fifteen minutes in, and we have three characters created, though. That's not bad. Ooh, here we go. Yep, this is a good one. Zachary. Alright, another. Doing true neutral on this one. Zachary says, ever taken the first roll for a character without re-rolling? That seems like some kind of man. <laughs> no, I have not because I do Iron Man runs. Here's the deal. With Iron Man runs, they are drastically harder than save scumming with terrible rolls. So, save scumming, you can make anything work. You just reload enough times. I don't like doing that. Uh, dexterity is not good enough. If I had a balanced party, 
and took the first roll and I did humans. I might build the iron mana, but it would be rough. Ooh, this is good. This is a good one. Uh, no one else has chatted, so no one else is getting their name after him. Add. Got one more character if you want something named after you. Make sure to chat. Crimson said safe scumming can make anything work except XCOM terror missions. Really? Why's that? Uh, Constitution's too low. Hey, actual welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Thank you. I am definitely feeling better. Tomorrow would be the two-week mark for having COVID. So it's taken me about two weeks. Still cough occasionally. All right, so Actual is going to get a character named after him. It's our sixth character. Need 18 intelligence. Character name Steve? Yeah, I can name it Steve if you don't want actual. Dexterity is too low. You can only have three rangers in these games. I don't know. Some of you probably know that. If you tried to add a fourth one, it won't let you do it. It's the only class that it limits the number you can have. Which is kind of odd because paladins are actually a little better. And you can have six paladins. Crimson says XCOM terror missions, you have to prevent aliens from killing civilians or you lose a ton of points. But aliens are hard to kill, civvies are easy to kill, the randomly generated maps constantly place mobs of aliens and civvies right next to each other <laughs> on the other side of the map from your squad. So it sounds like the game cheats. A scam. Oh, dexterity's too low. Always want, here we go. No, dexterity's still too low. So 
does not want to give us a better dexterity with int and strength. Dang it. Uh, hit points are a little on the low side, but I'm taking it. Steve. All right, we have our characters. Here we go. Moody says the game cheats. If I drink every time that happened, I'd pass out in 20 minutes. <laughs> Crimson says XCOM is mainly famous for teaching people about probability like how a sniper shot with a 99% chance to hit can still miss in later games they patch this anything 97% and above is an automatic hit hmm I don't know it sounds like another scam Lots of old persons. Okay, ooh, stinking cloud. We need one knock. All right, we got our spells. <clears throat> Go get our equipment. The elves get a bonus with long swords and short bows. We're going to do broadswords on the half elves. Actual says, Mr. D Forte, what is your favorite of the gold box games? Uh, overall, it's Pool of Radiance. Um, I don't like that they're missing Paladin and Ranger, but the number of quests and the diversity of the overhead map and monsters and all that, and all the, the strangeness it has in it is makes it my favorite. I like Curse a lot too, though. And the first Kren game, Champions of Kren, is pretty fun. Uh... Even Gateway of Savage Frontiers, decent. Pools of Darkness isn't bad, minus 
having to teleport around all the dimensions that's a giant pain in the butt i don't like that and the seeker of silver blades is kind of a slog okay so we're gonna do long swords on these and then short bows let me double check it i'm pretty sure we do not get the bonus the Thaco bonus with the longbow, but let's test it. So with short bow, it's 13. Ah, now we do. Good. So we'll keep longbows then. Long sword. Longbow. All right. I'm tempted to get two-handed swords, too, for when we fight trolls. Let's get two-handed swords on the first three. Do more damage to them that way. Crimson says, Pool of Radiance? That's a weird way to pronounce Buck Rogers' Countdown to Doomsday. You know, Buck Rogers, it's a good game. I like it, but there, one of the big problems with it is the skills aren't all useful. There's a lot of the skills that are useless, and you don't know that playing the game. If they would have made all the, the skills useful in different ways, then that would have improved it a lot. Uh, this is interesting, the experience we have here. I wonder if we do one fight, if we'll have a level up do. Let me look at the manual real quick. 12,500. <laughs> we only need 600 experience to get to the cleric to level 5. Really, we need 1,000. Because it's going to get divided by 2. Ranger, level 5 needs 20,000. Okay. Gosh, do I want to do that? It won't help us too much, actually. And there is a training guild in the sewers. There's a hidden training guild. So, yeah, I'm not going to worry about it. Could get a glass of oil. You don't get a strength bonus with them, though. Okay, here's where we attack. Man, we are going to have a lot of disabling ability. Okay, we have to surrender. Crimson says, yeah, the skills are a scam, and the combat becomes a little flat once you get rocket launchers. But I really like the colors and the characters to a slightly lesser extent. Yeah, 
It's really hard. I'm trying to Iron Man. That first Buck Rogers is really, really hard. Because you can't heal very well. Actual says, anyone remember Betrayal at Condor? Yes, I do. <coughs> hey, Hom, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Uh, voice is doing a lot better. Thanks for asking. I'm not 100%, but I'm getting a lot closer. Okay, here's our big fight. Why is Zachary facing backwards? Sleep doesn't work. Okay. Old person will. You start to recognize it. Yes. Disabling ability with this party. Disable pretty much all of them. Yep. All right. So we'll go into the treasure room first. It's over here.
disabling them left and right. Moody says, have a feeling we'll, we will be seeing lots of stinking cloud. Yes. It's not as good as in a pool of radiance, but it's still really good. We found the treasure room. Oh, look at all this. All right. Zero. Long sword. We'll give that to Zachary. Fifteen. Pico of fourteen. That's a plus one. Dust. We got dust already. Now, let's see if this is dexterity. It is. So Moody gets a bonus. Nice. Magic user scrolls. Hey. see what they are. Magic Missile, Dimension Door, Feeble Mind, Fear, Fire Shield, Fumble. Alright. Perfect. Hey, Symbionts, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Symbionts is one of my longest term uh, f supporters. Good to see you. How you been? It says Azure Bonds, my second ever RPG. <laughs> Fond memories. Nice. You still do lots of traveling, Symbionts? Okay, let's here. Not much traveling, lots of coding stuff. Also been working on playing my game's backlog. Nice. It's fun.
coding and stuff for your personal. Oh, they're gonna run. I'll just let them get away. Escape is blocked. There we go. It says, yeah, I'm just working on some coding, some projects that will help to preserve some of our digital history. Fun side projects, although now I want to go play the whole gold box adventures again. <laughs> yeah, it's a curse, isn't it? Well, that's cool. That sounds like a fun project. Like a very worthwhile project. Popped in to say hi, time to eat some pizza. All right. I'm glad you dropped in. I'm glad you're doing well. Thanks again for support, all the support you do. Good luck with your projects. See if we can just let them get away. Escape is blocked. There we We will be able to walk farther this time. Yeah. Remain calm. Assassins. Ooh, we got some magic users.
Moody says, what did Fighter 1 say to Fighter 2 when they were both ready to advance? Can I level you? Can I level with you? <laughs> Person, hmm, is any of that magical? Nope. Train, foul smelling sewers. So here's some oat yolks. Thinking Cloud can work on them, which is kind of funny. Good shot. What is our Thaco, by the way? Fifteen, not bad. safely not really using sleep So these will want us to go get some treasure. So we're going to bargain. Agree. We'll kill some of these Odie Oaks. There we go. So it's just such good spell saves.
Not a stinking clouds. Sever goes down. Oh, they surrendered. Rough. That's a rough fight. Hey, Mr. Spock and Tim. Welcome to the stream. How are you guys doing? Sunday fun day. Chris has your bonds day. That's right. You doing great? Glad to hear that, Tim. Okay, so we give them their treasure. Perfect. I want to look for a hidden training guild. Troll fight. This is going to be rough. Let's hope we get our stinking cloud. Such a cheat. Tim says, seeing you play this makes it even a better day today. Glad to hear it. Rita says, you're getting trolled. <laughs> oh, bracers, girdle, ironstone flail steps. We're going to have to keep repeating. Plus one flail. Now the girdle is going to be constitution. Twenty-seven hit points. All right, let's give it to Steve. There we go. I gave him two hit points. I don't know what attribute this is. Charisma. Yeah, it's charisma. Might as well give it to Steve. And we'll have 18. Oh, uh, wait a minute. That's confusing. It doesn't raise your charisma over 17. 
But for Sever, it went from 15 to 16. That's a... I think that's a bug. Racers. Swan. Regular branded now? Okay. Yes, it is. Okay. Let's see if we can find this training guild. Here it is. Here we go. Time to train. Oh, uh, four hit points, really? Sever says, Ion Stones in first edition don't raise stats above 18. Correct. It, it wouldn't raise it above 17. That's the bug, Sever. Could it be a racial limitation, Moody says? It could have been, but it's not. Because he was Elf. Elves can have 18 charisma. Mr. Spock says, you probably don't keep a list of your failed runs. Eh, it'd be interesting to compare wins with losses. No, I don't. I mean, they're all on stream. In case you ever want to know. But no. Let's see. Six hit points, that's better. <clears throat> All right, and then Zachary, it's a fighter need for level five. 18,000, we have enough. We're not going to have enough gold. Because we can't appraise here. Appraise scam. Get prayers and dispel magics now. The cleric can't level up anymore, they're maxed. The ranger can, but not the cleric. Okay. Princess. You're thinking it's probably dangerous? Yeah, the Iron Man's are not easy. Especially since I do challenge runs on them. Okay, we're in the hideout now. 
treasure room. Too far. person. See if we can walk in here without. There we go. Gagging. Interrogate. we did. Well, shoot him down. He's trying to walk through the cloud and reach him. All my guys gagged. Failed their saving throw. Okay. 
Man, way too many random encounters. person sure makes that a lot less painful. for the treasury room. the treasury room. It's a lab. Checkpoint. Here we go. This is what we wanted.
Magic long swords. Fourteen. Thirteen. Nice. Plus one, zero, but gain movement. Hey. Plus one, five. <laughs> Cursed. I always fall for that. Okay, go fifteen. Well, wow, okay. Fifteen, fourteen. Fifteen. Thirteen, that's a plus two mace. Sixteen. Fourteen, that's a plus two foil. Necklace of Missiles. Alright, cool. Alright, checkpoint. Let's get a buff or two going. Prayer. And bless. Oh, it's a weak one. Big battle coming up here. Prayer. Yes. Ah. Let's try this again. Tom says, well, full attention now, just ended another stream. The XCOM error from the deep run is going great, but it's an exhausting game. Hmm.
Okay. There's the leader. the necklace and missiles here. Sivir says, first boss fight. Not really with a boss monster per se, but just a mob of enemies. Yeah. Exactly right. Guys are super annoying. Hey, Bo, welcome to the train. How are you doing? I'm doing better. Not 100%, but much better. Sever says, and all the bo bosses to follow in this game have mobs. Yeah, they sure do. says we can start to recognize his voice. He says more stinking cloud. Oh, yeah. And more old person.
probably going to start running like chickens. Nobody got knocked down. A lot of money. Oh, a magic back day Corbin and longsword. Fourteen. 13. Okay. It's the same. Yay. First bond is gone. Gonna camp. Excellent. Journey on. I think I want to do Dagger Falls. Yeah, this is where we have to fight Displacer Beasts. Okay. Gonna delay and let them come to us. Okay. Let's try a stinking cloud. Two of them. Trading blows. Overloaded money until we get to the next town. <laughs> Tom says, The more the better, right, Moody? Enter city. Here we go. Oh, they don't have. Oh, 
don't have a training guild. At least I need this stuff. That's only a plus one. I'm going to sell it. That's cursed, which I can remove. Tesh wave. Oh, really? You don't have a training guild? Finally. Here we go. Level 5 Ranger. 4 hit points? Are you kidding me? With 18 constitution. Wow, Sever. You are so far behind. Crimson got 5. Moody got 5. Zachary. Fireball time. Let's get haste. Fireball. Level 5 fighter, yep. Fighter. These guys aren't ready. Okay. Moody's way ahead with hit points. He's got 52. Mr. Spock says, looks to, like to me this is a pretty balanced party. Um, yeah, I would say so. Yeah. Later in the game, they're going to struggle a bit. But I'd say overall it should be pretty good. Okay. So the next place for us to go is down here, the draw. I want to do this. Great slash the forest. All right, why not? Monster lair, investigate. Where's the monster?
I don't see anything. This place would be so good. Those are way too good. Bo says invisible, sneaky cat. Yeah, I need to get the invisibility spell for sure. I might go to Zenil Keep and buy uh some scrolls. There's probably a scroll that has it on there. Loops, groups. Hey, Cody, welcome. How are you doing? How was your your Doom uh, stream earlier? Cleric scroll, magic user scroll. They don't displace much in this game, he says. Then I'll keep. <clears throat> it was pretty good. The new content was surprising. I like it a lot. Cool. Scrolls here. Oh, holy moly, we got a raid from Board Game Heaven. 28 Raiders, welcome, Raiders. Let's give a shout out to Board Game Heaven. What were you just streaming, Board Game Heaven? Thank you so much for the raid. I really appreciate that. As you can tell by his name, he does all things board games. <laughs> Great to most, Atari Beer Pong says, and welcome Atari Beer Pong. Played another mission of Thief 2X. Nice. Do you play that against other people or do you solo that on stream board game, Evan? It's a total fan conversion. Hmm. We had to look at a bunch of Transformers. It's a solo game. Ah, okay. Cool. Stealth. Nice. How did it go? 
Uh, adventuring's going good. I'm doing an Iron Man run of AD&D Curse of Azure Bonds. This is a challenge of three cleric slash rangers and three fighters slash magic users. It went pretty well. Glad to hear that. I do a lot of old retro games. Um, lots of challenge Iron Man runs. This is just one more of those. Okay, I'm going to keep the rest of my money here, I think. Is that what's your favorite game at the moment? Board game, Evan. Board game that you're playing. Okay, good there. Eh. I'm not invisible. I really don't want to do this. Lee. See if one of these scrolls has invisibility on it. I don't think it does. As regular invisible. I don't see invisibility. 10 foot radius. That's okay. All right, these. <laughs> I know that's got to be a tough question. He says, there's so many cool board games. I love a good dungeon crawler. Hero's Quest has always been a favorite. Hmm. Yeah, and if I remember right, <clears throat> you're not a big fan of the Euro strategy ones, right? My wife and I play a lot of those types. It says, yeah, I'm more of a themic gamer. I do like abstracts, though. Cool. There's just, oh, there's so many games. There's so many board games. It's such a curse, isn't it, to not have enough time to play them all? Oh. That's the challenge, isn't it? Trying to decide what to play. Mr. Spock says, I like those Raider graphics in the chat. Little paratroopers. Yeah. Okay, cool. Let me think here for a moment. So we don't have visibility tempo radius. Really need to get that on level up. Let me take a look at my experience. What do I need for level six? Magic user needs 40,000, but we actually need more than that because we're dual class. It gets divided by two. So really we need 30,000. We're so far from that. Oh. We have to have that, though, to fight the drow. If we don't have invisibility, we're not going to be able to fight the drow. So, let's start some fights. Okay, we can do this. What we need to do here is hit the magic users first. Thinking Cloud will interrupt. So they can't kill. Jimmy says, ooh, just getting in at the end of the start of a new Iron Man run. Hey, Jimmy, welcome. How are you doing? Yep. Yep, we are. It's Fireball. Oh. Yikes. I need to dispel that. It's going to 
going to be too late. Ah. Yeah, it's too late. There goes Moody. Your teammate is dying. That failed. Oh, here we go again. Seriously? Seriously? How convenient. <laughs> Their stinking clouds work, mine don't. I know my teammate's dying, but guess what? We have to kill this mage first. Oh, I think we have, I think we have four or five dead characters right now. I can't bandage. And the elves can't be raised from the dead. So I think we, had, we just lost like half our party. Is he dead? Yeah, dead. Dead. We have two dead elves we, who we can't raise. And he's dead. We can raise. He's dead. We can raise. They're half elves. Let's get the bracers. I think. Eh. I know some of this is magical. I think the chainmail might be. I think the the uh, light crossbows may be too. <laughs> Jimmy says Deporte keeping the ditch digging companies in business. And maybe says what's good for the goose is good for the gander. Zachary says what makes the difference between raisable and unraisable? Elves can't be raised from the dead. That's a race limitation of them. Hum says how could this even happen when the one we would not name isn't even here? Yeah, I did not want to do that fight. Because I didn't have invisibility. But my my guys failed so much and their stinking cloud succeeded so much. We got really scammed there. That was like scam after scam. But it's not a party wipe. We can recover. We'll just have to create new characters. We have enough money here. Um, let's see, where will we need to go? Let's get out of here. Let's go to Flan. No, actually, I don't want to go to Flan. I think we'll have to do a fight. Go to Tesh Wave. Journey on. Boonlar. Okay, temple. Where's my jewelry, dude? We're gonna have to sell a bunch of this stuff. Heal. Crimson's cured. Moody's cured. 
This is where it's not going to work. I'm going Zachary. But we'll do it just for fun, just to show. Cured. Hey, it's a bug in my favor. Elves aren't, you can't raise elves from the dead. <laughs> but the temple allows it to happen. Okay, Board Game Heaven, thanks again for the raid. And check out Board Game Heaven if you're really into board games. He really knows his stuff. <laughs> Jimmy says, all thanks to this guy, Gary Gygax. Stinking cloud scam. And Moody says, what? The game cheated in your favor? Yes, a bug went in our favor. Can you believe it? We still have to scrounge up enough money here. Let's see. It might be enough. Yep. We lost constitution on everyone, but that's okay. All right. We're not going to be going fighting those again. I thought it wasn't going to have magic users with it. But it did. <laughs> Jimmy says, I do remember Kiffer mentioning this one. How he could get his elves raised at the temple. Yeah, I knew in pool you could. And they fixed it at some point. I think in Seeker of the Silver Blades, they finally fixed it. Now, if you try to cast the Raised Dead spell, it won't let it happen. And then, Pool of Darkness is even worse. The Resurrection spell doesn't work on Elves. And it's supposed to. So they scam you really big on that one. Zachary says, phew, almost got scrub wiped. Jimmy says, it didn't work in Savage Frontier games. Yep. Yep, the newer ones, they, they corrected them. Okay, so we're broke. Let's go back. We uh, don't have enough to train. Anything to sell? Let's sell these potions. We don't need that. Oh, here we got bracers. That'll give us plenty of money. I don't think anybody can train. Alright guys, I think this will be a good place to stop. Uh, let's see about raiding. Let's pass on the love of the raiders. What do we got going here? Oh, Sever's rating. Final Fantasy X. Let's send you over to him. Final Fantasy X. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time.